testing version 637. The most dangerous are the crashes that delete the files. This might happen also when you are exporting. The best to avoid a big loss is to split your project and keep your stories under 30 frames. This issue happens on landscape videos and reels. If the app crashes when you are exporting, most likely you will not lose your file. If it happens as you are working, you either lose the file or the last changes. Using some props also crashes the app. The following path also crashes the app. Create, offers, select a plan, my plan crashes the app. A terrible problem is that randomly we can't submit a report. In that case, kill the app, reopen the app, and report session number six. Another main issue is that I need a doctor. I can't move my limbs. I still have expressions though. Other characters also have problems. Where are my eyes? Look at my hair! You might get a black area if you are importing pictures with transparent background or gifts. Selecting the language of content doesn't work. The audio might keep playing even if you select a different track. I found the expressions of a character that was not at all on my video. And the expressions obstruct all the right area so we can't move the characters. Also, quite often, the control bars overlap each other. You will also face a lot of recording problems. Microphones disappear and it takes a long time to load. You will need to kill the app. The cinematic effects first time release are not working well. I just wonder why they insist on releasing things without a proper testing. And we still have to face the very long loading processes. For over a year, I have been reporting the speech bubbles problem. And um, yeah, it is still here. I didn't want to ruin my video using background music. We know that it is still a problem with that. Oh no! 32 frames! I hope I will be able to export it. Thank you for subscribing and thank you for watching.